Ayo, duckies, Andy here. So, people are having issues with CPU usage creeping up, and it's usually because they're using transparent video as a MOV format in a huge file, like we're talking like megabytes, gigabytes, huge files, where that is not the most efficient way to use a transparent video. Most people think that that's the only way, but there is a, a, a version that you can use called WebM, and WebM is so useful. But converting it can be a nightmare. Yes, there's online free converters, but this tool right here that is completely free is available and can be run locally on your computer. I'm going to show you how easy it is. You just jump to Nerd or Die's website just here and you can just download it right there, add to cart, put in all your email, blah, 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 blah. Check out. There's no strings attached or anything like that. You just download it and it works straight away. As a reminder as well, they've actually got a sale on now and my affiliate link is in the description. So if you want to help me out and you want to get yourself something nice, please consider using that. So once downloaded, you'll have a folder just like so. We can open that up and I've got a, a file in there already that's nine megabytes and that's the VLC file as you can see. It's the .mov and it's just a little video of my one of my new products that's coming out and it's not even loading it. So it's because I've exported this from my Mac and I've not got the codex installed in VLC, but we'll be able to see it actually work. All we need to do is just double click this convert.bat. The file needs to be in this folder for it to convert it. We just double click it. It will open the batch file. Um, Mr. Boost created this, which is cool. And it just goes through, bosh. That's it, done. And then now you'll see I've got a WebM file just here that's seven seconds long of one of my new products that I've been making. For some reason it's full screen. I don't know why that is. That looks silly. And it's converted that video just there. Something important to note is, as you can see, the Dynamic Stream Island MOV is just short of 10 megabytes in size, seven seconds. And then the newly converted one is less than 200 kilobytes. So straight away you can see how much more it's compressed and you don't lose a lot of quality at all. So definitely get using this. So I'll throw that file into OBS just here, like so. And as you can see, it is completely transparent. So this is a demonstration of one of my new products that is coming out very soon. It's actually an early access now if you want to join on tier two membership. It's an all-in-one widget. You'll come and see it on twitch.tv forward slash Andy Lippy. All the links that you've seen in this video are in the description. Please consider using my affiliate link as well. And I will see you in the next one. Like, subscribe, put your rock over the stone.